click on the subscribe button for more exciting videos and tap on the bell to get the latest notification about new videos hello guys welcome to my channel my name is sovik and you are watching sovik tech world so i'm back with another video and in this video guys i'm gonna show you top 5 features of flyme 6 so if you are waiting for a long time to know what are the new features of flyme 6 and if you haven't updated your mesu smartphone on flyme 6 then you need to watch this video so i already uploaded many of the flyme videos you can watch them too so if you want to know what are the top 5 features of flyme 6 then you need to watch this video till the end so guys without any further ado let's get started so first on my list comes the inbuilt screen recorder of flyme 6 when you slide down your top part and now you get the option of screen recorder you can see the screen recorder now you have to tap on this to start the screen recorder and as you can see a new pop-up showing uh, the actual time and you got the start option on the right side so you need to tap on the start and you can see 3 to 1 and the recording is started now you have to tap on this end option to end your recording and as you can see new notification on the top bar and your screen has been recorded and you can see the recording is playing the second top features on my list is the multitasking feature we already saw the multitasking feature on Samsung phones but now Flyme has added the function too. To use the multi window feature you need to open your settings or YouTube channel or many other options you got. Now after opening your settings you not need to close the setting and now you have to slide upwards to open your task manager. Now you can see the settings. Now you have to tap a little longer and you have to slide down and here you got the option of multi you need to tap on this multi option and your screen is now divided into two parts now you can use both your applications at the same time you can use your settings or you can open any apps from here now let's open play store so i'm opening the play store as you can see and you can adjust the size this is a play store i can use my play store and at the same time i can use my settings so multi window features is a great feature of flyme 6 the next feature on my list is the pedometer the pedometer is a new function added to flyme 6 and it's a great feature pedometers shows you the actual footstep how many kilometers or how many steps you have walked in a day and you can see how many calories you have spent on walking uh, the distance so you can see these are my footsteps and it actually shows your walking step not if you are traveling on your cycle or on your bike or car it doesn't count them it only counts the walking step and at night on 9 or 10 clock you got the result of your of your footsteps so this is a great feature you can use this feature and i like this pedometer very much the fourth feature on my list is flyme's new snapshot feature so when uh, you open your browser and search for anything like meizu and if you want to take the snapshot of this page but you can only capture the page you can see that only your screen size snapshot so let's capture a snapshot first and as you can see now you have to tap on the save option and now see the snapshot it's only the screen size snapshot but you want to but you want to capture the whole page snapshot you can see the page is very long and you want the full page snapshot then you got a new option to capture this long size snapshot after pressing your lock button and volume button at the same time you got this option and now you can see here is a arrow 
and you need to tap this arrow and it will select all the page and the page is very long as you can see and when you're done selecting the whole page now you can leave it and you need to tap on this save option and the page is saving and now you can see I captured the whole page the whole Google page and the page is very long so that's a very good feature you don't uh, need to select the screen size photos only screen size snapshots only you can capture the whole page at once the fifth and the last feature on my list is the kids mode when you go to your accessibility and you got another option of kids space so kids space mode allows your children to play with your phone without destroying any of your personal files so you can give their children your smartphone so that they can play games and many of the features are also available so you don't need to worry about your personal file that they can destroy the files you can easily give your children your smartphone so you can see there are a lots of options anti addiction timeout and uh, low battery lock and accessible app you can select any app which you want your children to use you can select all of them and when you are done selecting then you need to tap on this enter kit space and you have to give a password you have to set a password set now now let's set a password now when we now when we tap on this enter kit space it will automatically redirect to the new world of children so as you can see it shows only the apps i selected to be used in kids space so your kids uh, cannot use any of other apps and if they want to leave this place then then they have to enter the password so that's a very good feature for your children So these are my top 5 features of Flyme 6 and that is all. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you find this video useful then give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share this video with your friends. And if you are having any problem with your Flyme or Music smartphones you can leave your comment in the comment section below. I already uploaded many of the Flyme videos so you can watch that too. I am giving you all the links in the description link below. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel then the subscribe button is below this video. Tap on the subscribe button and tap on the bell for more exciting videos. So thank you for your precious time. I'll be back with some more exciting videos. Thank you.